All right, there's a new trade rumor and a wrinkle about this Golden State Warriors Utah Jazz trade rumor. This one comes from Steve Kerr himself on 97.5 The Game. Speaking of material, uh, the Jonathan Kaminga question, because it seemed like he was either shopped or not shopped, almost traded or not almost traded, and here we sit and he's still a warrior. How do you feel about Jonathan Kaminga and his ability to take that now fourth-year leap into being your real second-best player? Well, first of all, you know, you have to understand that there's very few players in the league who who are not talked about in trade discussions. You know, I mean, it, Steph Curry is not being discussed in trade talks. Everybody else is, you know, and, and for, you know, if you went down the list of NBA teams, the Lakers probably not talking to anybody about LeBron. You know, you just – everybody's got maybe one or two guys who they're off the, off the table. Um, so the vast majority of the NBA, the players are, are constantly, you know, going to be discussed in trade talks because everyone's trying to do the same thing, which is improve their team. That's actually a crazy clip because those hosts ask Steve Kerr about Kaminga and potentially being the second best player on the Warriors. And Steve Kerr immediately goes into talking about how, all players are talked in trade talks except for these specific guys. Like he mentions Steph Curry. He mentions LeBron James. Does that mean that he knows they're talking with the Jazz about Kaminga and Lowry Markkinen? It certainly seems like it. The other interesting aspect of this clip is when you consider it from the Jazz perspective. When you consider that all these teams have untouchable players, Steph Curry, LeBron James. What's interesting is that Lowry Markkinen is not mentioned as untouchable for the Jazz. It's obvious that Kerr knows about it. That makes this rumor from Brett Siegel at Clutch Points really interesting. He mentions that it's not clear if Kaminga is on the board for Lowry Markkinen. And so it sounds like maybe Maybe the Warriors might be willing to do that. But the other interesting thing is that according to Siegel, teams interested in marketing are expected to meet with the Jazz Brain Trust in person at Summer League in Las Vegas in an attempt to further trade talks. So it may just be a matter of time. Will they go to Las Vegas, sit down, and hash out a trade? We'll find out. Guys, like and subscribe to the channel. I'll talk to you next time.